The sun is trying to burst through the clouds as I head up to Speedock. Why Speedock? Because I've heard that up there, there's something going on with the job creation project with a group of women in Speedock and someone from the United States, and I don't know what's going on. So as always, I'm gonna go up there and see the what's and the why's and the how's and the who's of who's trying to create something good in Armenia. So today, it's Spitak on Timi Ginumekyu. It's gonna be fun. Aha, uh aha. -huh, uh -huh. So you guys are already at it. Okay, what do we have? Um, we're just uh, discussing uh, these prototype products um, iPad case, laptop case, pencil cases, wallets, coin mm. purses. Okay. So we're just talking about uh, what we're going to change, what we're going to improve on uh, the current uh, prototypes that we have. Okay, okay, why don't we sit down and I'll ask a few questions. Sounds okay? good. Mm -hmm. okay. Sounds good. Armina, uh, a few years ago on Temeginumegyur, we came to New Spitak, a different place, and y your husband had uh, a small pro and and you, I assume, had a small project going on handicrafts. And after that visit and after that show, this is several years ago, a project was started here by something called the Homeland Development Initiative Foundation, HDIF, and they uh, asked you to make some bags and created a name called Spitak Bags. Um, how has that gone? Ha, <laughs> Եվ հետո մեր մեր ապրանքները ավելի դժվար են վաճառվում եւ գնային անդհատ փոփոխություններ են լինում մատերիալի նյութերի առումով մեր առաջին նպատակը գնայեք է որ կանայք ունենան աշխատանք ու այդ կանայք իրանք նաեւ ունենան նոր մասնագիտություն որպիսի կարողանան պահեն իրենց ընտանիքները մենք հասել ենք դրան մեծ դժվարությունների գնով The missing piece of the puzzle is is um, a professional design on the product. Perhaps. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> <laughs> You're actually the reason we came today because we know that you've been working for as a volunteer for HDIF to create some new designs using new fabrics and, and things. How did you end up in speed talk designing bags? Yeah, it's uh, it's it's crazy to think that I'm here now, but um uh, the reason why I'm in Armenia this summer is actually through um, the Armenian Youth Federation Eastern Region. We have a internship program during the summer where they have a select number of AYF members who 
uh, just recently graduated high school to people who are actually studying in college or are graduating. Um, they come here for two months and what we do is we get put into internships that are related to the field of study that we're in uh, back home in the United States where we're studying in school. I chose HDIF because um, it's all about creating a sustainable product that is made here in Armenia. And I thought that was very interesting and an interesting challenge for myself. And from there, I uh, the first project I was assigned to do was to design the bags uh, from Speedock. It's definitely uh, really exciting, to say the least. I mean, like being able to physically hold the product in your hand that you designed is um, probably the most rewarding feeling when it comes to designing a product in any case. Um, from becoming a sketch to a physical, tangible object is... Um, really rewarding and exciting. And I'm going to ask the same thing of Armine, if you don't mind. Armine, what's it like working with an international student like this in industrial industrial design? Um, you know, personally, personally, my favorite is clearly the pencil case, the the round one. Mm -hmm. That that for me is just a, a beautiful, a beautiful piece of work. No. How many women do you have that are, when there's work they come, and when there's no work they're doing other jobs? How many women, is that? what I think it's safe to say is that if somebody out there says, I will take 150 of those backpacks, you can keep seven women in Spitak, where life is not easy, fully employed for about a month. That's the base, that's the bottom line. Amine, Ale, thank you very much. Thank you. Well, that was another really long, interesting day going out to some place in Armenia to see what's going on, what's the good stuff, what initiatives are being taken. Today, it was a trip to Spitak, to something called Spitak Bags an organization created in partnership with the Homeland Development Initiative Foundation in Yerevan and they've been trying to develop products that speed dog bags can produce and that can be marketed in Armenia and abroad on a large scale in order to properly employ a group of women in speed dog, where jobs are really needed. Then along comes a guy named Alec, he's connected to the AYF in the United States and he decided to use his summer here in Armenia He's an industrial designer, and he was given the task by HDIF to create a series of bags that Speedtalk Bags can make and HDF can sell. So, a little success, success story by a few good-hearted people from here and there getting together and creating the groundwork for a successful creation of jobs in Speedtalk. So, that's just an indication of how relatively easy it is for an individual from Chicago or somewhere else to make a difference in Armenia. Be sure to join us next time here on Time Genume Gyur. Now, I'd like to go home and crawl into bed. See you next time.